Hello everybody! Today I'm going to demonstrate the Gram stain technique. This stain is used to make bacteria visible under a light microscope. I'm going to stain two heat fixed lines of bacteria. This one looks clear, this one looks opaque. I'm going to place my slides on the staining tray and add our primary stain, Crystal Violet. Make sure you add enough stain to completely cover the smear. Now I'll wait 60 seconds. Now I'm going to rinse off the excess crystal violet with distilled water. Spray the water above the smear and not directly on it. It's okay if a little crystal violet remains at the bottom of the slide. Next, I'm going to add our mordant, iodine. Again, add enough to cover the smear completely. Now we wait 60 seconds. Now we're going to rinse off the excess iodine with distilled water again. Just like before, let the water run over the smear. Don't spray directly on the smear. Normally, for the decolorizing step, you would hold the slide at a 45 degree angle with your hand or a clothespin. But I've mounted the slides in a special holder to make the decolorizing process easier for you to see. Notice that one smear is much darker than the other. I'm going to apply our decolorizer ethanol above the smear here and let it run across the smear. As I do so, I want you to watch the color of the runoff that accumulates at the base of the slide here. I'm going to add our decolorizer drop by drop. And I'm going to continue until the runoff is almost clear. Keep watching the runoff closely. When finished, I'm going to rinse immediately with distilled water. Again, spray above the smear, not directly on it. I'm going to decolorize this slide in the exact same way. And rinse immediately with distilled water. Again, spray above the smear. Now I'm going to apply our counter stain, Safranin. Just like with the primary stain, I'll add enough drops to completely cover the smear. Now I'll wait 60 seconds. Now I'm going to rinse off the excess counter stain with distilled water. Just like before, Spray the water above the smear and let it run across. The final step is to blot the slides dry with bibulous paper. Just place the slides on the paper Close the pad and press down lightly so you don't break the slides. Now they're ready to be viewed under a light microscope. 